Women with high risk pregnancies sometimes have to stay in the hospital for months before giving birth. They're often scared, anxious and bored. Well, administrators at Centera Norfolk General hope that this will help. Today they cut the ribbon on a newly renovated and expanded antepartum or prenatal unit that's been seven years in the making. Kelty Bransford lights up at the sound of her baby Ryan's heart beating. The best sound in the world. Doctors sent them to the newly renovated antepartum unit at Centera Norfolk General earlier this week over concerns about Ryan's growth. Your initial thoughts is, is my baby going to be okay? You know, what's wrong? Um, how serious is this? The unit has grown from 15 beds to 21 beds to accommodate a growing population of high risk pregnant patients. Our main goal is to keep patients pregnant until we stabilize the baby and the mother prior to delivery. We're going to go ahead and get a heart tone now. Ivory Bishop and baby Cairo arrived before Christmas. It was like devastating. I cried a little bit and, you know, just fought through every week. The goal is to keep her here another three weeks. New state of the art equipment will help staff monitor mother and baby and larger rooms accommodate family and friends. Our patients are here anywhere from one day to six, seven months. So it's imperative that they have their support systems. The renovation has been long awaited as COVID put a pause on construction. And while the moms to be we met are quite pleased with the look of the new floor. I have this made this antepartum poster. It's the feels they get from the staff they appreciate most of all. So most of us, you ladies, are more than just um, our nurse. Y'all are like sisters, mothers, aunts, and friends. I know my stay is temporarily, but the love and respect I have for you ladies will be forever. The renovation of the antepartum unit is just part of a larger reno, which includes the new mother baby unit that opened last February, as well as new labor and delivery space.